I've been weight training since I was 16 years old. I'm 46 years old. And this is the first year that it caught up to me, meaning my elbows, my shoulders, my knees. Everything is starting to, I wouldn't say break down, but show signs of um, damage, uh, you know, uh, joint inflammation. So Ed, who's a very dear friend of mine, told me that he was having a good experience and did a lot of research on your company and personally talked to a lot of athletes and UFC fighters and wrestlers who've had tremendous experiences. So I figured, why wouldn't I take this opportunity to come back with my dear friend and experience you know, this company, experience the town, and um, it's been a great experience. Would highly recommend it to any of my friends and family. I believe from what I've seen in just such a short period when I did my stem cells through the IV, I went to the gym every single day. Uh, I mean, working out's my number one passion in life. And I, my pump in my legs and my arms was amazing. For the last 18 months, I couldn't get blood flow into my triceps and I, I'm known for my arm. So when he tried to flex his yeah. tricep or bicep, it was still like a little soft but the very next day, all of a sudden he's like, hey, look at this. And it's like, boom, and it was hard. And it's, holy crap, I can't believe what happened that period, one day. The IV, you were saying the bicep, and so, so that was with the IV only? Yes. Yeah. 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 One day, all of a sudden it was like, when he tried to flex really hard and contract it, it would only go so much, then all of a sudden it went, mm. after one day, you could feel it again. I got sensation back in my tricep, and my bicep, where I can get the blood flow just from con contracting that it felt like it did a couple years ago. Yesterday he had uh, both shoulders, both elbows, both knees, and some of his discs in his back. When, he, when they used the wheelchair to get him to us, because when he woke up he was like, his knee was on fire. Just one. And he couldn't put any pressure on it when he got back to us. He used myself and Stan Efferding as his crutches. As the night went on, he got better and better until all of a sudden he didn't, he couldn't scooch along by himself. This morning, when he walked at breakfast, he would like swing his hip out a little bit, but walk by himself. Then all of a sudden, by this afternoon, his knee was flexing and he was able to walk slow, but very normal, no crutches, way less pain. The experience would not nearly be as good, honestly, if it wasn't for the people at BioAccelerator and, and how everything is run. Every, everybody is so nice, so fun and joking all the time that it really makes it much, much easier.